friends welcome and welcome back to my channel it's your girl brother Mina, back with another video i'm always just happy that you guys choose to show up on my channel so thank you so much to you today i'm taking you where the cargo pants are you guys have really requested for this particular one and of course i don't want to disappoint really appreciate everyone who's been texting me and telling me that they've got some very cute items from the places that i plugged you so i really just appreciate anyone who just sends me their picture of whatever they got from Gikomba. Thank you so much. It really makes my day. It makes me see that I'm helping you guys. So like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Let's get right into it. So guys, I am really just excited on this cargo pant that I got. I just absolutely love it. Got it for 300 Kenyan shillings. Let me show you what I am talking about babes look at this guys i can't imagine that i got this perfect piece perfect cargo pant at 300 kenyan shillings and it's just absolutely awesome i love the pockets i love the belt i also love the detail here you can see that it has that cute belt look there also i just love the fit as well it's also like not going all the way down once i wear it so i'm definitely going to be rocking it with some black boots and let me tell you this is a look by itself i absolutely love it the material is also really perfect guys i just absolutely love it for 300 kenyan shillings i feel like it was a steal please tell me what you think about it guys i think i'm definitely going to be styling it with like a tube top a white or a black one it will go perfectly especially since it's just gray it's a dark gray one and here guys this is the first piece that i got for 300 kenyan shillings i feel like it's a steal a huge one and i can't wait for you guys to see how i'm going to style it so please make sure you're following me on uh, instagram so you can be able to see how i'm going to style this cute gorgeous piece i didn't get so many pieces this time but the things that i got were actually so worth it and you guys will tell me if they are the next piece that i want to show you is something that i've never had in my closet probably just a green one but this is just a different totally different color it's a camouflage cargo pant guys look at what the combat decided to serve me with let me tell you that this is something that i am so obsessed with i got this one by the way for 500 kenyan shillings so it was a bit higher because the demand for this type of pants is really high so yeah guys i got this one for a way higher price than the other one since i got the other one for 300 kenyan shillings but let me show you what this pant looks like guys it's absolutely perfect you guys will be the judge of it i love that it has some back pockets it also has this pocket it also is it's really like really long so it can fit someone who is like really tall as well i feel like it's something that is a staple especially if you're trying to just change up on your style and everything but i absolutely love it uh it might be a little bit expensive but it's something that i needed as well so i could not leave this piece especially and also the color you can see that i got two gray items this one which is like the camouflage and the other one which is just plain gray but apart from that i absolutely love it please tell me what you think about it definitely i'm going to be styling this so nicely and i can't wait for you guys to also see how i'm going to rock this piece as well so there's actually a backstory to how i was able to get these cargo pants let me tell you guys it was just like a wednesday i usually go on market days and i told you that is monday wednesday friday or saturday so i left and it was uh, i was getting to gikomba like at around 11. so once i got there i was just looking for like the outfits and everything and to just look for cute items so i looked and i was actually in that place for a dress where i told you guys where i got my dresses my bodies uh like the jumpsuits and also the bags that area where it's known as quad dress and guys that's when i just bumped into this guy that was selling the cargo pants and he was not actually selling them like a big like a bail that he had no he had actually chosen what he was going to take to his shop so he was not a seller from gikomba he's a seller that is around koja he told me where he's located so that's where i found him that area known as quadres so that's where i got the good like uh, cargo pants so i started looking through the items and that's how i came across this 
uh, the cargo pants guys and I just fell in love especially with the camouflage one and I just needed to get it so for that one he actually sold it really high as compared to how the cargo pant like the other one was for that one he sold it for me for 500 Kenyan shillings and after bargaining guys because he definitely knows that he's going to sell it at his shop for more so I had to bargain up to 500 it was initially like 800 and I told him that I only have 500 and for this other one I got it for like 300 Kenyan shillings and I just felt like it was a still uh, considering those items that I got and the style and the look and whatever I had in my mind on how I was going to style them and they are just some pieces that never go out of style so I had to buy them for myself so I'm going to make sure I leave the contact of this guy so that if you're looking for cargo pants you can be able to easily access him and also he's around town so it's easily accessible for everyone that's just how I came across this uh, cargo pants I was just running my errands in Gikomba looking for the best items and I came across this and I could not uh, like leave those cargo pants because once I leave such pieces it's really hard for you to just get such pieces and especially for just that amount so please call him and tell him that I sent you if you're looking for the cargo pants and yeah you can find any other style because if that's what he deals in and all those cute pieces the wide leg and those cute pieces I'm sure you're going to find something that you're absolutely going to love something that is even unique just like my pieces yeah guys that's i think basically everything i want to explain for you for me i'd say it's just luck that i was able to just get them but it's not something that you guys can't get because he deals in this type of outfit so you are definitely going to just get what you want as well and even probably something that is similar to mine because there are times that you actually get two things or three things that are different sizes and also just from the same veil so once you go there don't forget to just be patient guys look through everything look through every veil that you just find whatever you're looking for just choose one by one always have time and always have the energy to just look through all these thrift pieces i'm really grateful for all those people who've been telling me that they went and they called the sellers and they were able to like get some very cute pieces people have been sharing what they've been getting by the way on my instagram to me so i'm really excited for that and i'm really just happy that you guys are getting your items so that makes me so happy it makes me know that i'm helping someone to even start a business so I'm sure this is going to be handy to anyone that doesn't know where Gikomba is so from town you let's say you are just in town and then you want to actually go to Gikomba so you have to be in Luduli Avenue guys it is right behind National Archives you just have to be in National Archives ask for Luduli Avenue it's directly opposite and behind archives so once you're in Luduli Avenue you have to find the matatus that go to Gikomba and this matatus are number seven number seven are the matatus that go to Gikomba they are like some Nissans so you're going to board one of them and they are just right there so once you're in Luthuli you won't even miss them you can just ask a guard and be directed there it's really easy and you can just see the matatus there so once you get to Gikomba you have to find these areas that I usually say here so I've ever mentioned Gashosho I've ever mentioned the fish market I've mentioned Quadres I've also mentioned Soli so it just depends on where I direct you guys and depending on where you want to get these items and what you actually want but I advised you guys that you should be calling the sellers first so that you can see and hear if they have like uh, the stock there and good stock also if they're opening the bills that day so that it can even make it convenient for you to go on that particular day that you want to actually go to Gikomba yeah so those are the items there were just two of them but I think I'm going to make them like look extra cute especially when i style them so if you're not following me on instagram please follow me there so you can see how i'm going to style these beautiful cargo pants that i was able to get and also tell me which cargo pants you liked most and how you will even style it if it was yours so yeah guys 
I think that's the end of today's video. It's always a pleasure having you here. I hope you liked this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you were able to even leave a comment down below suggesting any other video ideas that you might have for me. I'm always trying to just satisfy you with every type of content that I put out, whether it's vlogs, whether it's where to find something. So the effort that I put, I always just see the support that you guys give me. So thank you so much for that. I'm always appreciating it. So until next time, I'm hoping and praying the best for you. Keep on succeeding. Keep on going for your goals. You can do it, babe. I'm going to see you next time. Peace. Mwah.